Greetings and salutations, friends. I am the Wolf. I got my coffee. Today we are building Transformers Cyclonus. This is a sleek, sporty, fun, and powerful little C-Class fighter that you can build in the comfort of your own home for the low, low price of 600,000 credits. So without further ado, let's get into the build. Before we get into the build, let's take a look at what we have on the sprue. And what we have on the sprue are all of the unique parts that we are going to need for this build. Starting with the Himeji Command Bridge that you can purchase at Tayo Astroneering on Neon in the Voli system. While you're there, you can head over to Stroud Eklund where you can pick up the Poseidon DT230 engine, the SAL6330 engine, and the Pinch 8Z reactor. From there, you can skip on over to New Homestead on Titan in the Soul System. That's where you'll need to purchase these four NG20 landing gears. And then lastly, you'll want to head on over to Parima at the Red Mile where you can pick up your Scan Jammer. Everything else can be obtained on your landing pad at any of your outposts. So let's uh, select all of this, get rid of it, and get into the build proper. So first of all, we will start with our landing bay. That's the NG6 by Nova. We'll put that guy right there. Then we'll head over to the HABS tab. And we're going to come down here to the tile 2x1B variant. And I want that to be my infirmary. We'll put that guy there. Onto him we will attach the 2x1A variant from Tayo. And this guy is going to be, I think I skipped over it, the all-in-one. And we'll copy this guy and put a captain's quarters. That will go right there. And then the last habitat we will need is this companion way, the B variant. That will go right there. Next, I'm going to add a little bit of structure so I have something to build off of. So I need my Structurals tab. And I'm going to start with this Deimos hull. I want that guy to go right there. And then that guy can go right there. Then we'll head down to the Stroud Eklund section where I want to get the mid bracer. And I'm going to add three of them right there. And then copy and paste over here just like that and then while I'm down here I also want to get this Stroud Cap B that guy is gonna go there and then bloop, you'll go right there and now that I have the skeleton of the ship let's uh, get into the meat and bones and starting with our cargo we're gonna add this Galleon S204 cargo hold right there Onto that, I will go ahead and attach my shielded cargo, the 10ST hauler. That can go right there. Next tab is cockpits. So I'll get my Himeji command bridge and place that guy right there. Next is the dockers tab. So we'll grab our 100 DP slim docker from Deimos, flip it upside down, and put it right there underneath my all-in-one. Next on the tab are the engines. So we will come down here. We'll add these SAL 6330s. One there and one there. Perfect. Then I'll add the Poseidon and we will put one here and one here. Perfect. We'll skip equipment and fuel tanks for now. We're gonna add our landing gear. We're going to take this NG20, he's going to go right there, and we'll copy and flip to the mid variant, that will go there, and then we'll copy and flip to the wide variant, and we'll put one there, and one there. Now we'll go back to the fuel tank tab, and we'll add the H40 Atlas, we'll put one there, and then flip, you'll go right there, beautiful. And then next is our grav drive. So we're gonna take the J52 Gamma, 
We're going to let that guy go right here. That's his home. Then we'll go to the reactors tab. We'll get the pinch 8Z. And this guy will live right there from now on. Beautiful. And then our shield. We're going to grab the... Uh, <laughs> I can't even speak. Once the mic is on, my mouth stops working. Assurance SG1800. There you go. That's how you say that. We'll put that guy right there. And now the bulk of the ship is done. Now we're just going to start adding a lot of structural pieces. So let's start at the top of the structural tab. We got a horizon weapon mount here. That guy is going to go right there. And then flip, flip, flipadelphia. Um, and that guy is going to go right there. Perfect. Next is the Deimos bumper. We're going to put one here. And then flip, flip, flipadelphia. You're going to go right there on that side. Beautiful. Next, we are going to find this Deimos spine C. We'll put one there. One there. And next on the list, we need to find this guy. This Deimos wing A. That's going to go there. And I'm gonna, going to delete that. I'm going to copy this. Flip. You're going to go right there. Delete that. Don't worry, there's a method to my madness. Next, I want the wing D from Deimos. Flip it to the aft configuration. That'll go right there. And then flip. You're going to go right there. Perfect. And next is the Hope Tech nose. We'll put one there. And copy and paste there. Uh, perfect. And next we will find... We will find... I promise you we will find... There we go. This Nova Wing. Flip it to that configuration. We'll put him there. And then flip... Put him there. Perfect. Next is this Nova Weapon Mount. This guy will go right there. And we might be close to being done. I just want to get this Stroud Cowling 1LA. We're gonna flip, flip, flip Adelphia. We will put one there. And then flip, flip, flip Adelphia. Put one there. Beautiful. And then copy and flip. Copy this Hope Tech nose and we'll put one there. And then copy, put one there. And are we done? I think we're done. Yes, we're done. Beautiful. Alrighty. So yeah, uh, we just need to add the weapons. So let's go to the weapons tab. And you can, of course, add any weapons that you like. Any weapons you wish. Any weapons that tickle your fancy. So these are the weapons that I'm adding. And they're my favorite weapons, and they're, ones I've, they're the ones I've specced for, so they're the ones I'm going to use. I'll put these lasers right here. Right here. I'm a big laser. You will go, come here, go to your home, please. You too good for your home? Uh, screw it. Copy, paste, there we go. Excellent, and then we'll add our... Gauss guns, we'll put one here. Come on. Go, friend. Please cooperate. Hey, thank you. And then copy, and there we go. I knew these guys were going to give me trouble. There we go. Beautiful. And then we just need to add one more thing. And that is our scan jammer that we skipped over earlier. We'll tuck him in right... Come on, where are you? Right there. Beautiful. So no one will know he's there. That'll be our little secret. Just you and me. So now we'll go to our weapons and assign them. Uh, laser. Uh, Gauss gun. And missile launcher. And there we go. That is Cyclonus. So now let's exit out and take a look at the color sliders. Okay, friends. For our color sliders, we are starting with this blue that we used on most of the ship. And that puts the hue slider right just about in between the O and the L of the color 3 tab. Saturation is all the way to the right. 
and then brightness is halfway above the eighth color box there at the bottom. The darker blue is the same as the lighter blue, it just puts the slider about midway above the fourth color box. Then we have this purple that we used here on these little pieces. And that puts the color sliders, it puts the hue just halfway under the R of the color 3 tab. Saturation is all the way to the right. And then the brightness is set about halfway above the seventh color box. And then finally is the white color that we used on these two engines. And that puts the hue all the way to the left, saturation all the way to the left, and brightness all the way to the right. And there you have it. Those are our color sliders. And this beautiful ship is done. So let's exit out of this and take a look at the interior. Okay, friends, coming in from the landing bay, we enter right into the infirmary. So let's kind of back up and take things slowly. Hello, Sarah. Uh, take things slowly, take it all in, get a good look of everything. <laughs> Never noticed that Know Your Workers Basic Rights poster before. Um, so yeah, we have this nice infirmary. Coming through here, there's our research lab. Looking good, looking beautiful. Coming through this door, we enter into the all-in-one. That gives us a nice little cot, a lavatory, with some rags on the floor because we're messy people apparently. Got our sarcasm poster. I need to get a sarcasm poster like that IRL. Got our cooking area, galley rather, eating area, another little desk, another little seating area with some more immersive clutter. I enjoy that. And we come into the captain's quarters with our navigation console, little seating area, our bed. Can't wait till the stuffies load in. I love those things. Another little desk, the all-important coffee maker. Can't have a shit starship without that. Are you crazy? Got our lavatory and our caffeine poster and that is basically the ship let's run back here so that we can uh get out of the way sarah <laughs> run back here so that we can hop up into our companion way and through this door we'll take a look at the bridge if you saw my last build you've already seen this bridge but we'll uh chill out and take it all in anyway watch our little uh transporter ships land there but yeah this is our uh build this is uh transformers cyclonus without further ado let's exit out and take a look at the 360 of this ship And there you have it, friends. There is Transformers Cyclonus. I hope you liked this ship. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you found it helpful and informative. And I look forward to seeing your own versions of this build in the Starfield Ships subreddit. Thank you for watching. Good luck and happy gaming. Bye bye.